Something is seriously wrong here. Mm -hmm. The music, though, the soundtrack, I like it. You said it yourself. This isn't following protocol. She's right. She has a point. She definitely has a point. I don't know. Come on. As an ex policia, aren't you the least bit concerned? Hmm. Fine. I am, I guess. Listen. First, we've got to look for witnesses. Find a lead. Mm -hmm. Now we're getting somewhere. So, who is that guy in front of the church? Miss. It's Padre Eusebio. Harmless. The all. <laughs> Padre is an all. I like it. Harmless. They enforce their family traditions, turning women into obedient caretakers. Ooh, you go, girl. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> but he might not actually have something to do with this. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's. Yeah, political, the, the, the oppressive regime, it's everywhere. It's in the church, it's in, in the education system, prison system, whatever. It's all just another grab for power. He's not someone I can trust. I'm liking this game so far. This political undertone, it's so cool. Those things are changing, even within the church. Are you sure? You just have to be patient. I don't think so, you're gay. Change doesn't come from patience. Hmm. Padre? Take a picture of Padre as well. Waiter, sure. Who's this guy? Is that a crow? Musician. <laughs> that is like a mechanics. Is the other one? Hmm. Anyone else here? Wait a second. That that gorilla is still there. Sure. Hmm. Look for signs of witnesses. Did the priest see anything? Oh, I could talk to the priest. Andre Eusebio, I guess. Let me see. There are no officers down that end of the street. Go. Okay, I mean, she is going to talk for us, I guess. Let's see. Yeah, go and talk to the Padre. Hold on just a second, guys. I need to check something. The music is so chill, though. What happened? Did you talk to the Padre? He doesn't know anything about the shooting. Mm -hmm. Claims he was asleep at the time. Hmm. Makes sense. Sure. He also said they should have taken the body away by now. She's, she's right. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely a political statement. This assassination. But let's see. Anything else? Who can probably? Okay, Grandma. Where are you, Grandma? There you are. Hmm. Musician, go and talk to the musician, maybe the waiter. Look for signs of witnesses. Did the priest see anything? No, he didn't. So? 
<sighs> Who could have seen anything, guys? Chat. Who do you think might have seen anything else? Hmm. Oh, maybe this chick? Hold on. second uh the glass roof over there was it already broken maybe it wasn't what was that look at that mess hmm somebody stayed at the archway i wonder when you say beyond know where he's gone the bomb Hmm. Hey, I saw Eusebio talking to that bum who lives near the archway yesterday. Hmm. Seems to keep an eye on him. Okay. Try asking him if he knows what that bum was doing yesterday evening. Sure. Let's ask that as well. Oh, what is that? He seemed to recall seeing Aldo lie down out there yesterday evening. Uh -huh. And? Who's Aldo? The homeless guy. Try to keep up anyway. When I <laughs> pressed him for it, he clammed up and didn't want to talk anymore. Almost seemed Why? to regret mentioning Aldo in the first place. Hmm. Might be Aldo is someone who's related to him. Ah, indeed. I'll keep an eye out for the bum. Maybe he knows something. I'll go into the cafe and see whether I can find out something there. Sure, yeah. you do that. Maybe you can overhear some conversations. Just tell me if you spot something. Okay, I'm I'm on the lookout. I'm on the lookout. There she is. Nothing to do all day, huh? Mm -hmm. Who are you talking about? Lola, the, the singer from the cabaret. It works most nights. Maybe she saw something. Maybe. I'll go talk to her. You do that. Still putting the moose on Lola. The waiter. Maybe there is hope for both of you. Fall in love. Quarrel bitterly. Die old. This guy is bitter. <laughs> Worse ways to live. And what's now Lola? Is a good time to ask Lola about the previous night. Mm -hmm. On my way. Go 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 go. Don't talk near the waiter though, but whatever. The waiter is a fox. She Where are you going? At home, but didn't see anything. Uh, hmm. You can't trust anyone down there. Is there anyone in this world you actually like? You no, know, because I'm an Why asshole. Would I like artists who push their own political agenda. <laughs> they all do. This guy's an asshole. Definitely an asshole. Everything is political. Look around you. Life is. Definitely. Definitely. Well, Whoa. It didn't used to be. It didn't used to be because you were living in a fascist regime. You remember, Jorge? Because all art that wasn't pro-government used to be repressed. Definitely. This chick knows what she's talking about. Thanks for reminding me. Wow. This political undertone, it, I like it. I like it. It just reminds me of Disco Elysium. Okay. Lola is moving out. 
What did she pick? Did she pick something? Did she just pick something up? She did? What is that? I should take a photo for later. Oh. Where is she going? What's she doing? She's going back? Wait a second, what's... She did pick something. Hold on. But I need to observe the cafe, I guess. It's going where, though? Wait a second. Yeah, I just lost her. Let's get back and observe the cafe. What else? What else? The waiter. Where's... What? The musician is there? No, he's not there, but... Whatever. I think Lola picked something up. Where's our journalist friend? Where is she? Where did she go? Hmm... This soundtrack is awesome. Yeah, Grandma. I think you saw something, Grandma. You definitely did. You definitely did. Tell us now. Uh, where's the flower? Where's the carnation? I think it's gone as well. Maybe our journalist friend picked it up. Hmm. There you are. What are you looking at? What are those? Why don't you talk to the waiter? What are we waiting for? I feel like we're done with the cafe for now. Yeah. Hmm. Nobody left. We should take a look at the cabaret. Sure. Is anyone standing near the cabaret? Observe the cabaret. Sure, sure, sure. Let's see. Let's see what's happening. Okay. Our muscle friend, gorilla friend, is there. Sure. I've got an idea. El Blanco. See the big man at the cabaret entrance? Let's what go about there. Him? He looks cautious. He definitely El is. Blanco is their bouncer. He won't let you through. Mm-hmm. Well, Carmen sometimes comes down to check on him. Hmm. You could listen in if you're quick. Yeah, move there, move there. Come on. Where are you? Are you going there? No, she is just still standing there. Why is that? New clue added. Mm hmm. Officer. That officer. Let's go ahead and check the cover, right? Hmm. We need to find out something else, I guess. Or we proceed. Where's Carmen? He's not there. Where is she? Hmm. Is anyone standing near the cabaret? Sure, a Blanco is there. Observe the cabaret. I am. Still observing. The other officer is a snake? <laughs> Hold on. He is. I think he is. Look at him. <laughs> Just love it. This chick is... 
What is she? A squirrel? Is she a squirrel? Hmm. Hmm. I think we need to find out something else. Oh, there she is. Carmen is over on her roof terrace having a smoke. Who's she? Runs the cabaret. Bunch of leftists, shady folks, weirdos. This guy has a problem with leftists. Basically anyone the nationalists would consider unwanted. I see. Probably means she hasn't seen anything either. Mm, can't be Agreed. sure. She wouldn't tell you. She makes sure to stay out of things like this, to keep her people safe. Mm hmm Okay, Carmen seems nervous. Okay. He's out there. They're arguing, I guess. Okay. Observe the cabaret. There she is. I do want. They're arguing over something. Okay. Carmen just went down to talk to El Blanco. Mm -hmm. Try to get behind the van. Yeah. You do that. Just a second. You do that. as well mean they're hiring a new singer hmm. sure but it seems more serious than that hmm anything else oh, they've lowered their voices don't risk getting closer yeah okay they're done talking Lola is coming over. There. There she comes. Mm -hmm. Looks like an argument. Yeah. Are you getting any of this? Yeah, moving closer, moving closer. We need to hear them. I think it's about money. So much for communism. When it's about paychecks, everyone's the same. <laughs> this asshole. I don't know what, but you're definitely projecting something. Definitely, definitely. it maybe I need to find out oh curtains are drawn hmm can't see inside I think we can't see inside nope curtains are drawn anything Oh, there she is. Our pretty singer just ducked to hide from the Polythea. Really? I'm starting to get really interested in her. I'm going up to talk to her. Oh. Not with that brute guarding the door. Yeah. She's probably getting ready for work anyway. Nothing happening at the cabaret. Hmm. Investigation isn't going anywhere. We just started, You've kid. Only just started. These things take time. Definitely. I don't have time. I need to find out what the mole was going to tell me before all leads disappear. The mole. Yeah. How did you contact him? Yeah, it was the code name the victim used when he contacted me. 
old lady across the street. Where's the old lady? You mean... Where, what? The old lady across the street, meaning... Grandma? Just for the record, don't worry. You are not a suspect. Yet. Okay. Okay. Donna Anna is a turtoise. There's an elderly lady in the building on the other side of the street. Mm -hmm. What about her? She an anarchist as well? <laughs> <laughs> well, according to Jorge, could be, she could be. She's always up there. If anyone saw something, it'll be her. Which apartment's hers? Uh, right across us. buzzer with the name Anna. Tell her Jorge sent you. She'll love that. Well, not, but yeah. Hmm. It looks decent for a for an indie game. As well as I'm concerned, yeah. Which there could be more details. Maybe even another... Hey man, I'm at your lady friend's place. Uh -huh. She's not my lady friend. She says she wants to talk to you. Whoa. She does? And I kid you not, she has her own transmitter. I gave her our frequency. She'll connect in a moment. Um, wait. Are, are you serious? <laughs> Jorge. Jorge, is that you? Oh. Uh, <clears throat> Hola, Senora Ana. It's been too long. So, uh, I have a few questions. Jorge, how have you been? Are you holding up all right over there? <laughs> Where is she? I never go to bed on time. Not since the accident. She is actually spying on us. Not spying, but I wouldn't call that spying, but yeah. I talked to Sebio. He says you stop coming down for confession. She knows everything about us. She does. Wow. Um. Sure. Yeah, listen. I know it's been a while, but I was hoping that maybe we... You know we had an electric elevator installed here? You should talk to that landlord of yours to get one too. Would do you good. Not loaf around up there all day. Signora Anna, please. I need to ask you if you could... Your friend told me already about the shooting. We need to... We what need to a mess, more. eh? The policia only guards what's important to the regime, as always. Yes, they do. Anyway, I didn't see nothing. Are you sure? I see. Thank you for your help, Senora. But I bet Aldo did. Hmm, the bomb. He was down there last night. Tramp. Ran like the wind. You mean you saw the bomb? Are you sure? I'm old, but neither blind nor stupid. Go ask him. I know what I saw. She has a point. We might we might interview. Thank you, Senora. Aldo. If there's Hey man, we have a real lead. I'm gonna go down. Just a moment. <sighs> Let me finish a sentence for once. Hmm. Where is Aldo though? Where's Waldo? So the homeless man. Where is he? I don't know. He hasn't returned yet. I'll let you know if I spot him. Mm-hmm. Those mechanics. Wouldn't hurt to take some photos. Sure. <laughs> Always working on that one scooter. Yeah, there's something a little fishy about it. 
There's another place you can try. These two girls, they recently moved into the garage in the square. Mm -hmm. Grown women aren't girls, Jorge. <laughs> Just love this journal check. Perfect. Do you mean the mechanics? Yeah. Uh, yes, I, I don't know them. It's a long shot, but I think their lights were on last night. Yeah. And their glass roof wasn't broken. At least not last night. Something's going on there. Go and talk to them. I'm heading over now. Mm-hmm. You should. Hmm. Wish we could hear them talk. Okay. How about the other one? Did you talk to both of them? Let's see. Luisa and Marietta. They're Italian. Moved here recently. Mm hmm. Seems like a couple of parts for one of the scooters have gone missing. Hmm. Do you think it's related? I doubt it. The sisters think it's just some kids playing around. Okay. So nothing for us there. No. Said they were shocked when they opened up this morning. How about the lights? Day, there's a corpse lying on your doorstep. Ask her about the about the lights last night. Hello. Uh, I think we should keep a lookout for those missing parts. Hmm. What a waste of time. Maybe. But if they know something, getting on their good side could prove useful. Hmm. Find and return parts. Really? How do we do that? <laughs> okay. Hmm. Missing parts. Where could they be? Hmm. Could they be in the garage? Probably not, but. Baseline started again. Hmm. I need to find those um, missing parts. Oh. Is that a scrap? I think there's a part behind the car by the cabaret. Uh huh. Yeah. Go there. Hmm. This one. Is that it? Maybe. Maybe that was it. There's a Fusatsi lying here. Where is it? And pick it up. Okay, go and talk to the chicks. Hello? How do I interact with that? Maybe it's inside the car? Where is it? Um, what are we looking at? I know return parts, yeah sure, but where are they? Can it track with anything around here? 
Hello? Yep. What are they talking about? What is she looking at? Um, I don't know. There was nothing else there, but... Hello? sure what we're looking at right now but let's see let's just wait for the counter let's see what will happen after that Enough distractions for now. We should have another look at the neighborhood. Okay. I'll look around a bit again. Mm-hmm. Was it the plaza? Okay. Get back to it. Yeah. Broken windows. Got me something else. Oh, there he is. Look who's decided to come back. Go and talk to Aldo. Your friend Arno is here. Arno? You mean Aldo? Right. Well, where is he? His usual place by the archway. Mm hmm. Are you going there? Yeah, she is. She is going there. Let's see. They're talking. Well, that didn't really go down the way I expected it to. Hmm. Why? What happened? What did he say? Nothing. For now, at least. Did it seem like he was scared or something? Yeah. Said the policia have been giving him a hard time lately. He wants to meet me in the church garden after sundown. Guess you have to play along. I took notes of your findings. Let's go through them. Be there in a moment. Hmm. Why didn't we talk to the waiter though? Yeah, talk to the waiter. Is she back? Yeah. No, she okay, is. Okay, so what now, Mr. Eye in the Sky? See that chart? It opens. I'll pin my drawings to it. You put up the photographs. Mm hmm. Okay, I've marked the main parts of the story. Hmm. So. The story. I told you I'm working on this piece. We need hmm. to recreate the order of events. I've saved some space in the middle. Just put the clues in order there. Let's see. During the witnesses, how did we identify the victim? Because of the carnation. He was wearing a red carnation like we agreed. Yeah. And... What else? Right. 
Murdering witnesses. Uh, I don't know. We definitely don't know. Hmm. Might be Aldo. Doña Ana saw Aldo from her window. Mm -hmm. She said he fled the scene. I wonder what he knows. Can we maybe move them? I need to think this through. Can we maybe move them around? That doesn't nope. make sense. Doesn't make sense. Yeah. He was wearing a red carnation, like we. Right. Mm -hmm. Doña Ana saw Aldo. She said he fled the. Scene. I wonder what he knows. Mm hmm. What about this one? Where was Aldo, the homeless man? That doesn't make sense. This one? That doesn't make sense. Uh, who was the journalist supposed to meet? Uh, this guy. With them. I was supposed to meet a guy. Called himself the Mole. Mm hmm. And why were you meeting him? Yeah. He contacted me, said he had something that would help my career as a journalist. <laughs> that is... <laughs> that's stupid. Uh... I was supposed to meet a guy, called himself... And why were you me? He contacted me, mm -hmm. said he had something that would help my career as a journalist. Mm-hmm. What actually happened? What actually happened is someone... Someone shot the guy. Someone got shot right outside my apartment. Mm hmm. Yeah, the question is why? Where was Aldo, the homeless man? Aldo stayed at the bench last night. He must have been close by when the murder happened. Mm hmm. That's it? This is the. Um. This is our reconstruction of the crime. <laughs> that is just now too bad, but let's see. The crime. We could start looking for suspects. Hmm. Really? That was it? Good start. I'll put that away. Can't have it out in the open in case someone comes by. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Name's Melinda, by the way. Melinda, nice to meet you. Jorge. I am asshole Jorge. Yeah, you told me when I visited Anna, remember? Let's hang around till sundown. Mm. Aldo better have some good info. Okay. This chick is going outside there to meet Aldo. So... So? What did you do? At the policia, I mean. Well, this and that. Killed people. For the government. You know, obviously. I, uh, I worked as an investigator of sorts. Is that where you learned to draw? Yeah. Have you ever thought about taking up painting? You know, like art and stuff. He's just so opposed to art and artists. This guy is an asshole. I haven't, um... <laughs> You'd probably be good at it. You should go down and meet up with Aldo. It's getting late. Sure, yeah. He should be at the church by now. Mm hmm Yeah, I'm watching you. I am watching you. Where's the... There's a camera. Anna Anna is there as well. Where is he? There he is. He's waiting in the church garden, mm -hmm. as promised. Good. I'm on my way. Yeah, go and talk to Aldo. Wait a sec. Aldo is a... Uh... 
Well, is he a cow? Is that a cow? Probably. Wait a second. Padre is coming over. Hello? Hello? Padre is arguing with them. Padre doesn't want Aldo to talk to Melinda. What's going on, Padre? I think he's onto something. Did you see what just happened? And you just started playing chess. The moment we started talking, Eusebio noticed us and made his way over. Yeah. He interrupted Aldo and pretty much dragged him away. Yes, we saw that. Did Aldo get the chance to say anything at all? Anything at all. He talked about seeing some tall fellow by the cabaret, nicely dressed. Hmm. Some tall fellow? Probably they're talking about the blue, greenish rabbit. Eusebio interrupted him. Nothing else? Not really. Said he heard the shot right as it came through the archway. Hmm. He took off the moment he saw the body. Maybe okay. there's some other way to get that information from Aldo. Aldo. Hey. Maybe Aldo tells you Sabio more. Meaning? Chess? Why don't you sneak over? Mm -hmm. See if you can hear them talking. Under the pillars? Yeah, just be sneaky, just be cool. Yeah, they won't notice you. <laughs> just be cool. <laughs> just pretend that nothing is happening. Come on. Listen to them. So? You did? They're talking about politics, the future of the country. What? No word of the shooting. Uh, we're gonna have to look for other clues for now. Hmm. Oh. How about... What the lights over there? Is that a, a printing press? It is. I think those mechanics are up to something. Yes, they are. They are. <laughs> Probably weird. they're printing um, illegal documents, pamphlets, political pamphlets. Let's see. They're concerned about getting in trouble, about people noticing them. Yeah. So they are up to something? They didn't sound like criminals. More like they're trying to hide something. Them and everyone else around here. They talked about a beggar being there last night. Oh, a beggar. I knew it. They are witnesses, and they lied to you. Not specifically lied to us, so. but. Wonder why they would lie. Because they're Italian. Because they're afraid of your fascist government this isn't getting me anywhere people have too much baggage i'll see if i can spot something and lay see. low don't draw attention yeah yeah whatever what can we spot like maybe something else How about... How about Grandma? I could give her a call. Mm -hmm. Daniana, are you there? Hello, Marty, hello? I was hoping you'd call. Hmm. Did you find the killer? Yep. We found the lead, but nothing conclusive yet. I see. Who did your friend talk to? She's not my friend. I'm just helping her investigate a story. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds friendly to me. Come on, Anna. Stop it. Um. 
We talk to Mr. Sabio. Eusebio said he didn't see a thing. Mm -hmm. And he interfered with Melinda when she tried to question Aldo. Okay, that's something. Part of it is just being a good shepherd, protecting his flock. Hmm. And what would Aldo need protection from? Mm -hmm. Who knows? But they are close. I'm sure Padre has his reasons. Definitely. We contacted the mechanics. Did we actually? We contacted the mechanics. They, they didn't tell us anything. No luck. Said they were fast asleep. I think I saw the lights on in there. We did. But we the also. The from my apartment makes it hard to make out. Yeah, we also saw that. Interesting. They were probably printing those political pamphlets. Did we talk to, to Lola? Melinda went and talked to Lola. She's a singer at the cabaret. Yes, I know her. Cute one and popular. Is that so? Hmm. Even the waiter at the cafe is trying to woo her. Seeing them takes me back to my younger years. Hmm. Okay. It's too Lola. much info. Thanks for your help. Talk more. Let me know when I can come over with some home-cooked feed. Okay, things escalated quickly. Uh, but yeah, thank you. Thank you, Anna. Shrimp fresh from the harbor. Thank you. I can't say no to that. It's been too long since we sat down for a chat. Really? Yeah, thanks. I'll be in touch. Hey. This might be a good time to look for some more scooter parts. Ugh, this again? I'm telling you, this is gonna lead nowhere. You never know where a lead might turn up. Mm-hmm. Let's at least look around for a few minutes. Fine. Why not return parts? Where are they? I can't seem to find them. Let's... There's scrap? something next to the phone booth. Okay. Hmm. hmm. Sure. Are you going over there? Come on. Faster. Faster. You need to move faster. Got him. And? That's it, we need to find more parts. Hmm. Sure. Where the where 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 we need to Let's see. Is there scraps? Where are they? I think there's a scooter part right by the tree. Outside the repair shop. Alright. Sure. Found another one. It's got to be around here somewhere too, but I can't. I can't locate it. I can't pinpoint it for some reason. Anyway. What were they thinking? What do you mean? Archway. Scooter one. frame. How'd they do that? Don't underestimate bored children, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, go and check those as well. Uh, what else? What else? This thing is heavy. That seems to be all of them. Really? We did Finally, it? Finally, I'll pop over to the mechanics with their junk. Tell yeah. me when one of them exits the repair shop. Like, right now, probably. Gone. Still waiting on them. How do I? How do I move? 
things. Hmm. Hello? Are you moving out? Maybe I need to wait for that two and a half minutes uh, for the counter to stop. I guess. There she is. Oh man. She's a. Uh, what's she? Like a leopard? Is she a leopard? Maybe. Are you guys still playing chess? They are. <laughs> it's weird. See if you can catch a glimpse inside while you're there. Mm. No need to tell me. Let's see what happens now. Let's be on the lookout for other ways to investigate them. Right. Mm -hmm. What's happening on the cabaret? Uh, is that a sound of a car? I think it is. Like... Here? Now, are you there? Come in. I've been here all this time, man. And did you just call me? A stranger who fits the description Aldo gave us just arrived at the cabaret. This or guy maybe. again. Could it really be the same guy? Hold on, I'll call in a moment. <laughs> the same guy. Yeah, he's 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 the rabbit from the Donnie Darko. Oh man. Hello? Okay, now they're talking. On the roof, tall guy talking to Carmen. Mm -hmm. I think it's our guy. I think. Stranger. Yeah. What's he doing? So far, only talking, but not in a casual way. They're arguing over something. I gotta get out there. How? It's dangerous, but fine. I'll check if the door is clear. The bouncer is keeping watch downstairs. Maybe you can slip in when he's not looking. Get ready by the entrance. Where exactly? Hmm. Reckon Melinda hide. You can hide over here. By the car, to the left of the entrance. <laughs> sure. Wait for my mark. Mm hmm Wait a second. The waiter? Is going inside there? Really? That was the waiter, yeah. He's not looking. Go. Go. Go, go, go. Fast. Lola's apartment. Really? You didn't. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> She's downstairs performing. It's now or never. You're wasting time. What about the just a quick peek? Sure, sure, sure. You she do that. Here. She might be involved. Where is she keeping her stuff? Hmm. There are some papers on the desk by the wall. 
can do that. Good thing I still have my pocket camera. <laughs> okay, we got some shots. Old newspaper. Hmm. With a handwritten message inside. Hmm. That is probably what Melinda picked from the um from the cafe down there after talking to the waiter. What's it say? Some meeting, time and place. Somebody has been contacting her through old newspapers. Knew it. Textbook espionage. Sure. Jorge, I hear steps outside. Oh god. There's a dresser at the back wall. Quick. Maybe Lola is yeah, probably after the performance, Lola is just Going up there. I'll dial down the volume a bit. Sure, sure, sure. Is that Lola? Yeah. There she is. The waiter, and she's with the waiter. <gasps> Hello? They argue about leaving together. Hmm. He wants to go. Lola doesn't. Uh -huh. She says she's left home behind enough times in the past. Oh, she's mad. She got uh, angry. Okay. Okay, what's going on? He's leaving as well. They left. Yeah. You okay. can get out. Get out of there. Past. Melinda up on the roof. How do I do that? Seems clear. You can get up on the roof now. Stranger, Carmen and El Blanco. Watch out for El Blanco on the way. Mm -hmm. I got this. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see if you got this. I'm up on the roof, behind the access door. Mm hmm. Okay, that Blanco is going down. Hello? They went into the glass studio. Shit. Can you see a spot next to the glass from your side? Hmm. This Blend one? By the ledge. Looks large enough to give you cover. All right. Can you see what they're doing? Uh. They're inside. Should be safe. Head for the bush. Okay. Not sure they're still on. Turn off the speaker for now. Be careful, Mel. Oh. Shit. The tall guy. He's talking about a list. What list? Seems really intent on finding it. What list? Talking. Jorge, I think the stranger is Policia. Oh, okay. He said they have a suspect. A uh, suspect about the murder? They're definitely discussing the night. <gasps> what happened? on the speaker again welcome back i think it's safe to uh, leave okay hold on he's talking to someone on the phone i guess i'm gonna stick around a little longer to make sure the heat is gone 
Sure, sure, you, Did you do that. Did you ever see that man when you were with the policia? No idea who he is. Never. Yeah, he's coming back. Could be a higher up. Could be new. Hmm. Do you know anything about an important list or something like that? Uh... The policia keeps track of all sorts of things. Yeah. Could be anything. Judging by his clothes and this conversation, he's both rich and influential. Mm -hmm. I'm worried about Lola. There's nothing we can do about it. Wait for Melinda to return. Sure. Okay. Come back. Come back. Fast. Observe the plaza again. Or what exactly? Body's they gone. Finally took care of the body. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this the body it's being left there uh, deliberately. This, this 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 reminds me of Disco Elysium as well. There's also another corpse hanging on that tree. Hanged by a mob. Yeah. And for some political reasons, obviously. Yeah, sure. What else? What else can we check? Waiter is back. Lola is back with him. Why is she running after him? Wow, you really can be a bit dense sometimes, huh? He's trying to keep her from doing what she loves. They care about each other. <laughs> Besides, what do you know about her life? You can't see everything through a pair of lenses. Mm hmm And those lenses are foggy. They're... So short-sighted. Are you guys still playing chess? Yeah, probably they are. Okay, anything else? How about... Oh, they turned off the lights. Hmm. Sure. What else? Uh... You're not coming back? Come on. Move up. Move up. We need to discuss. We need to discuss things. Okay. I'm heading back. Sure. Waited long enough. All right. Let's come over. Let's go come over on, the details. Hurry up. Go over the details and then. Okay. I'm looking for clues. Why did you knock? I mean, came over earlier. Took you. Uh. Hola, Jorge. How have you been? It's Diego. Okay. Hmm. Oh, hey. Sure. Hola, Diego. Didn't expect a visitor this late. Been a long time, huh? Mm -hmm. It has. It has. How are you doing, old friend? I'm doing all right. You know how it is. No. Just peeping around, <laughs> looking at people, bedrooms, and all that stuff. Never gets old. Hold on, um, just a second. Okay, need to check something again. <laughs> oh God. <sighs> hmm. You know how it is. Uh, hello? Where are you going? Heard you got promoted. <laughs> Word gets around, huh? Uh huh.
Uh, well, word is they got sick of your crying after I was taken off duty. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, once I didn't have to drag you around everywhere, the commander finally saw my potential. <laughs> what a load of crap. This is us on the wall. Right next to Diego. Uh, no, 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 no. There's just been a lot going on at the Don't station. Don't go there. Don't mention it. I get it. No responsibilities, living up to expectations. Yeah, yeah. And with the election coming up, and now the shooting. Hmm. All of a sudden, you showed up after that shooting. It is not even shady. Not one bit. See what's going on there. I heard you called it in. I did. I asked you Thought around. Myself. I was right there on the balcony. It took you long enough to get the body moved. Mm -hmm. What's up with that? I know, I know. But like I said, a lot going on lately. Fill me in. What's going Everyone on? Everyone works as fast as they can. You know that. Yeah. To be honest, I was hoping you'd seen something. Anything. Mm, okay, it's time to decide. It's actually time to decide. You know how when we worked together, every detail counted. Who's the body? Some pencil pusher. Hmm, another journalist? Uh, no one connected to the election, thank God. Everyone's on edge. The slightest spark could send this entire thing up in smoke. Didn't look like a robbery to me. I know. The whole situation's wrong. Help me out, will you? Please. Oh. Hmm. Aldo is like the witness. There's a bum hanging out in the area. How do I know I can tell all of these to this? But he is probably my safest bet at solving things because I am friends with this guy. If I were, if I were still on duty and on his position, I would do the same. Probably there's nothing wrong narratively here. Yeah, I would. Because I'm an asshole, I definitely think alike, like this guy. I would, I would go and tell him about everyone. Maybe not with what's going on with Melinda, but we'll see. Harmless fellow. Doesn't seem the type to commit a serious felony. But he might have seen something. He might. Makes sense. This is really helpful. Anyone else? There's an elderly lady. Lives across the street all by herself. Mm -hmm. She's usually up there watching the plaza. Uh, sounds like the perfect candidate for a witness. Yeah. Donya Anna's the name. Donya. It's on the doorbell. Great. I'll look into it. Yeah. Anything else? We're running out of... <laughs> Not look options here, but let's see. You might want to talk to Padre Eusebio at the church. Was he there? In the middle of the night? Um Hey, you ask him. I can't do all your work for you. Alright. I'll see what he knows. Anyone else? Uh, Melinda, why could I? Hmm, this looks suspicious. Maybe we should investigate with Melinda rather than with these guys. Let's see. No one woke up the next morning, and there the body was. I'll try to lie to our friend there. All right. <laughs> See what happens next. So who was the victim? Really? A 
as sharp as ever. <laughs> hmm. Now, we don't know for sure, but it looks like he was tied to some underground network. What, like activists? Yeah, hold to go. What do they care now with everything changing? Stir up conflict and panic. It's their only cause. Definitely not, but let's see. Let's see where this leads to. Did you notice any new faces around here? <laughs> they probably know. They probably know about Melinda. Okay. Let me think. Hmm. There's this fancy looking tall guy. Has been coming to the cabaret a lot recently. Doesn't fit the local clientele? Yep. Exactly. Wears a suit, polished shoes, the whole shebang. Don't know what he's up to, but he seems to have been in meetings with the owner. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Anyone else? No. Yeah. No, not really. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Let's see, Diego. Oh, hey, I just wanted to say, uh, I know you've had it rough. Thank you. Thank you, Diego. And the pain, and I can only imagine the boredom. Mm-hmm. Are you getting it? It wasn't your fault. You know that, right? I should have been there when it happened. Hmm. It's all in the past. Forget it. What are you getting at, Diego? Right. Well, uh... Back to the problem at hand, huh? Has mm -hmm. there been anything out of the ordinary? Anything at all? Uh... A singer from the cabaret got into an argument on the street with the waiter from the cafe, no less. It would seem like the usual love drama. No weapons involved. <laughs> right. Hey, uh... Hmm. Hey, uh... Heard anything from Ursula? Hmm. She wrote the other day. Haven't opened the letter yet. You haven't? You haven't. Ah. I won't pry then. Ah. Uh, okay. Hmm. I just omit these two very important information from this guy he is a copper i don't wanna hmm weird 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 let's see let me tell him about the printing press now that you mention it i did see something strange hmm Let's gauge his reaction. I don't understand what. There's an old printing it's press. Supposed to do right now. Down by the plaza. Mm -hmm. Seems like it's been printing again. How's that strange? The place is a repair shop now. Oh. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. There's nothing more. If there was, I would have told you. <laughs> of course. Let's see. I know that you're on our side. And, uh, what side is that? Yeah. Tradition. Of course. Tradition. And the right-leaning conservatives. That is the tradition. That is the fascist regime. Still working on. <gasps> Another visitor? No. You're quite popular, pal. No. Don't come in. Don't come in, Melinda. Don't you? Hola, oh, Señor God. Jorge. Okay. Oh, hey, kid. Hmm. Good to see you. Mama said to bring you some leftovers. Thank you. We just had dinner. Thank you. It's terribly nice of her. Tell your mom I said thanks. Yes, Señor Jota. We'll do so, Señor. Thank you. I think Thank it's time you. for me to go. It's getting late. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Drop by again sometime. Don't leave me with the dust rats for too long, you hear? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Will do, Jorge. Will do. Mm. 
Let's see. Okay. Well, that was. Uh, hmm. Two. Oh, Mel is all right. It's probably best to not have the two of them meet. Probably. At least for now. Hey, Mel. You there? Hmm. Hello? Hmm. Should finish up for tonight. Would be best to write down what we uncovered. We will, we will. Just a second. Let me eat. Don't really feel like eating. Whatever. Yeah, let's get back to our board. Or maybe here. I will. I will write down my notes of the, of the events of this day. But uh, after a short break.